all right guys if y'all seen my other video about first problem three years fixing the 8010 well the screws the stock screws they end up getting real skinny up here in the top they just wear down uh and they vibe you know as it the vibration over time they get too skinny and this this whole thing gets sloppy and so i ordered all new factory bolts um but the bottom one it wouldn't snug up the threads were a little messed up it would not snug up uh so when if y'all seen that other video i wind up putting a little concrete screw in there because it kind of is snugged up so i put loctite i loctite all of them i put loctite in there and snugged up that concrete screw well i was out on my mowing route today and i realized that that screw is gone it fell out so that did not work the concrete screw just like i figured it might not um so what i did was you see i went and got an m6 screw from the hardware store uh, I got two different links depending on what I need. Uh, M6, which I probably could have went a size one size smaller maybe. You see, it's a little bit big, fatter than that factory one. Um, but you know, it's already wallowed out some on the bottom. Uh, you know, just from how it was. So what I'm gonna do is drill it out. Just well, I just got two different lengths. One's like maybe one and a quarter, and one of like maybe one and a half. And I got nylon lock nut, so what I'm gonna do is right here on the back, put a lock nut, um, drill it out, try to find the closest drill bit I can to this, and that's that should repair it for good. Then I'm gonna just put the factory screws on the two top ones with more Loctite, put those back, and then put my bolt with a lock nut on the bottom. So I'll try to video it, um, you know, doing that process time lapse, but that's what I'm gonna do, and I'll show y'all after we get done. Um, I end up giving you guys the size of drill bit that I use and all that stuff. I'll give you that info in a minute. And, um, the wrench is really hard to hold up in there. You see the gas tank really gets in your way. Um, but you can hold 10 millimeter wrench. You can hold it at the perfect kind of angle, uh, when you, when you're putting it together. You gotta use the open end and see you kind of hold it like that. It barely works, but it does work. <laughs> I mean, if you had to, you could take the gas tank off and stuff, and you could get it get it easily. Um, but this is awesome that I got it fixed, and I'm uh, super glad. All right, boys. As you can see, it actually looks pretty good. It's a Phillips head. But check it out. Let's see if I can get you up in there. You see that? Oh, yeah. I like that. We got the lock nut. Um, it's an M6 screw. I end up going that longer one. It's probably like an inch and a quarter, inch and a half. And uh, as you've seen, drilled it out. It's M6, I believe, what it's called. It's a Phillips head. Uh, here's the other one. Which I'm not crazy about Phillips head screws, but I wanted something that would recess in here, you know. Um, so we got these. I got a couple washers, but... There's not really enough room in there to put a washer anyway. And that bolt is not going to go through that hole, so. Um, yeah, I think I think it's fixed forever now, I hope. Um, so, I believe it's called a... It's not listed on here, just the prices, but I believe it's called an M6. Um, and I drilled it out. You know, I had to try a couple different sizes. Because um, you don't want any the hole any bigger than you got to have it. The, the final hole was a 1564. 1564. I don't think you can see that on camera, but 1564 on the Milwaukee set. Um, man, very happy with that. Like I said, hopefully I'm now good forever on that. So what do y'all think? Leave me a comment down below if you think if that will last forever or not or what. I hope it will. It's got a nylon stop nut on there just like this. So should should not vibrate or anything. And if I need to replace that screw ever, if it ever gets small like these other ones did, I could just, you know, get another one of these, which this one's going to be a little too short, but get one like that. All right. Thank you guys for watching.